what's up guys so here i have a sparking blade of mirage fafnir as you can see in the video fake one well if you give a good look you can clearly see it's not fully useless i can't even use it on a bailet or i can't even make a combo using this mirage fafnir sparking blade so yeah it's now fully useless but i decided that why don't i just create a bailet using this mirage fafnir bailet sparking layer blade Nice. In this video, we are going to make a Beyblade X Fafnir Beyblade using this broken, useless, sparking layer blade of Mirage Fafnir. So let's get started. Alright guys, so here I have a plastic bottle cap like this one. I will use this to create the launcher hooks of Beyblade X launcher. I hope you understand. Okay. And if you're my old player, you definitely know what I actually do with this bottle cap. So anyway, I will show you that later. But first, we have to take out all the inner plastic from Mirage Fafnir Sparking Blade. Because this is actually creating issue while attaching the bottle cap. As you can see, I'm not able to fit the bottle cap into the sparking layer plate. So that is why, guys, we have to remove the inner plastic using cutters. So let me just quickly do that. It will take some time. Five minutes later. Yep, now this is what I call the real cutter. The hot soldering iron. <laughs> Guys, to be honest, the smell of the plastic is absolutely very, very worst for sure. Sala, बहुत ही गंदा smell आ रहा है भाई ये plastic का. पता नहीं यार ये कौन सा plastic से ये billets बनाता है भाई. I have no idea, guys. With which plastics these fake brands actually create this type of billets? The smell of the plastic is very, very irritating. मौत मुझे क्यों नहीं आ जाती है? Okay, everyone. Now the bottle cap is fitting properly into the sparking layer plate, as you can see. Well done. One, two, three. Okay, so I just don't want to mess up. So that is why I'm just marking the areas where I will do the cuts. I mean, I will add the cuts. So this is the areas. Okay, let me just quickly see if it fits properly or not. So yeah, as you can see, guys, fits properly. Not bad. Okay, everyone. Now we just need a report launcher like this one. If you have one, somebody here. We just need the inside mechanism. I mean, this gear part, as you can see in the video, guys. So we will use this on Fafnir. You know, it's a better X pillar, so we definitely need a X bit like this. Wow, absolutely looking like a. Bailed X Fafnir, bro. Cheese the bag, dum dum. As you all know, that guess Fafnir is a stamina type bailed, so I'm just trying my best to reduce the flatness of Fafnir. Meanwhile, nice. Show it. ये क्या? मरना तेरे को डर नहीं लगता? So I'm going to attach this small piece of ball type plastic part, which I got from this from my cycle bale. All right, everyone. Before doing the test, let's see how much this Fafnir X version actually weighs. Oh, guys. Unfortunately, guys, it's very, very lightweighted. So I actually forbad that Mirage Fafnir. You know, Fafnir is actually a left spinning bailer, but I actually don't have any type of left spinning launcher. So yeah, I have to spin this Fafnir in right spin way. I mean, right direction. So okay, let's go, guys. As you can see, it locked very well. Okay, now it's time for the real test. Three, two, one, go! Shoot! Okay, three, two, one, go! Let's go! Shoot! Oh wow, guys! With this powerful launcher, Fafnir is actually spinning very, very powerfully. But yeah, because of that ball weight, it's not actually able to use the extreme dash. But I think after doing battles, we'll able to see something, you know, extreme dash from Fafnir X. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Come on, Fafnir, use the extreme gimmick. Yep, very lightweight, and that is why it just lost its stamina very quickly. 
पे यार लॉन्च ही नहीं कर पा रहा हूँ मैं कम ऑन यूज एक्सट्रीम डैश रिंग आउट ओ केम बैक ओ गाइस भाई साहब Vibes, ring out finish. Nope. So just do it.